Hello Divine Collective, welcome or welcome back to my channel, Divine Goddess Enlightenment. I'm Ashley and I am here with a general energy read. As you come in, don't forget to subscribe if you aren't already. Make yourself at home. Hit the bell so you can be notified every time I drop a read. My self-published poetry book, The Unpolished Diamond, is available for purchase on Amazon. The link will be in the about section. I hope you guys are having a Fabulous, fabulous Monday morning. I'm doing well. <laughs> I, y'all, I just woke up with so much energy. Like, you could, like, I feel like y'all in this energy, you could have, like, so much energy because you, you just feel like things are finally falling into place for you. Things are manifesting for you. And you're, like, witnessing magic happen. You're witnessing the magic of the divine, of the most high. Like, things are really coming together for you. You could be, you're just in this happy energy, okay? It's a lot of people pressed about it, too. You're you're just, like, so unbothered. The people that betrayed you are sitting back, watching you, spiritually stalking you, and they're, like, in awe. They, they can't believe that you're so unbothered after the pain, the grief, the betrayals, the lies, the deceit, okay? You really, like have people in a head that's just what i'm picking up but we gonna have fun y'all spirit guides to the highest white light as i tap into this energy for my divine ones i ask that you give me clear channel messages i also ask that you protect me as i open myself to different energies thank you ashay what's the overall energy for this message spirit let's get some overall energy for my divine ones overall energy for my divine collective spirit What's the vibes? What's the vibes? Overall energy. Overall energy spirit. Overall energy. Damn, that's too many, my baby. I seen a star energy. Yeah, people, you, you, people have watched you heal from the worst. And people just can't seem to figure out why you so unbothered after all you've been through. Aquarius to be highly significant. What's the overall energy spirit? You could be dealing with an earth sign or an earth sign to be highly significant because earth signs are real stubborn and these cars are being real stubborn. <laughs> spirit, what's the overall energy for my divine ones? What's the vibes? Let's get the vibes, spirit. Are you telling me I should start with my other deck? Okay, I'm going to take it there. We have three of pentacles, like I said. Earth sign, highly significant here. I feel like spirit wants me to start with this deck. Get some overall energy from this deck. We have the initial B that I'm cutting on. The initial B could be highly significant. Brandon, Brittany, Byron, Brian, Bernice. Baxter, let's get some overall energy spirit for my divine ones. What's the vibes? Your ancestors are all over this. Okay, so this is this is going to turn out to be an ancestors message. I feel like the initial I is highly significant. Indiana, Irene, Isis. Okay, someone significant with black hair here. And we have African, okay? An African could be highly significant. You could be traveling to Afri Africa or you're planning a trip there. But it's a situation. Your ancestors is all over this, okay? I feel like it, it's the people that... The, it's people really pressed and bothered that you're healed, that you're unbothered, that you don't give a fuck about the betrayals and what these people put you through. Because... It only made you stronger. It only made you tougher. It only made you, yeah, copycat energy. This is someone, you have people like, this is a cap, uh, I can't make this up, y'all. An earth sign is highly significant, okay? Your ancestors is all over this. It's someone out here literally trying to walk in your energy, trying to be you. Try to copy your swag, your style, your essence, okay? It's someone literally spiritually stalking you. It's someone trying to emulate your energy, and that's just period. But spirit, your ancestors, like, is all over this, okay? It's, it's a person here that has people full, I'm getting. 
like trying to fool people into thinking they're the divine one when they're actually a karmic. This is someone that always copies you. This could be a childhood friend. This could be a family member for some of you. An earth sign is highly significant here, okay? Your ancestors is all over this, okay? Let's get some uh, tarot spirit. It's really people out here bothered by your success, your financial level up, bothered by the fact you've healed from a bullshit. And it's, 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 it's giving creepy vibes. Like, why would someone be that pressed over you finding yourself, elevating, growing, ascending? It don't, it don't make sense. All right, Knight of Wands, a Leo, Sash, or an Aries could be highly significant here, okay? People see that you you are passionately driven towards your goals. You are passionately making it happen. When all these people doubted you, all these people say you want to be nothing, and you run in circles around all they ass, period, okay? You run in circles around their ass. They don't know if you, rather they coming or going. These people so pressed on you, your growth, your elevation, they not even able to tend to their own, they own life, their own soul's mission. Half of these people are soulless anyway, karmic individuals. Like I said, these people cannot grasp the fact that you are thriving, growing, and elevating after this betrayal. After these people played in your face. They they are confused as fuck. Okay? Which is a good thing. Alright? It's not for them to understand. Okay? These people are heart heartbroken that you are not heartbroken. These people are heartbroken that you made it out. The trap they set for you. And the, di the ditch they dug for you, they fell in that motherfucker. Period. What's the energy, my babies, my ancestors? What's the inner? Yeah, down. This was flipped over. Ten of Wands. All right. It's, it's, these people are angry that you're, you, like, you, you carried that burden. You carried this burden like a G. You made it through that storm like, like a G, for real. You a spiritual gangster. Okay. Every rock that was thrown at you, you used to build your foundation. And they are in awe. They are shook. Okay. These people expected you to suffer forever. These people never expected for you to boss up the way you did. All right? A Leo is highly significant here. All right? This is the, the sun energy. You're very confident. All right? This is You're in a season of confidence, growth, elevation. Okay? Looking beautiful. All right? You're attracting a lot of energy. A lot of... I said a lot of energy. <laughs> A lot of uh, energy, a lot of attention, even if it's unwanted. A lot of you are attracting a lot of attention, all right? It's the, the Most High has shed the light on you and who you are. Chosen seed, the sun seed. Sunflowers could be highly significant here, okay? You could be getting some communication about a Leo, all right? About a tower here, Scorpio energy, okay? This is like I'm getting wow factor, okay? You stepping into your confidence literally costs a tower moment to your ops, to your haters. Okay? You're receiving a lot of good news. Like I said, what did I say at the beginning, y'all? Damn, that's crazy. I can't really remember. But you really, you receiving a lot of good news here. Okay? You're just in this energy of receiving uh, blessings, abundance, luck. It's a lot of luck surrounding you at this time. And people are talking about this. All right. Yeah. After going through a season of financial financial fluctuation. OK, you may feel like your finances are fluctuating at this time. You're going through some type of uh, it's a financial you're going through a financial uh, glow up here. OK. You do have someone that's always been very codependent on your energy this person thinks they're you i'm getting okay you have you really have people press you really have people the same people that can't stand you that hate your guts copying your every move and your ancestors don't like that shit. you are the original you are the blueprint okay 
It's no carbon copies over here. It's only originals, my baby. Clarify your ancestors are all over this, spirit. Clarify your ancestors are all over this. Okay. Four of Swords. I'm not going to show it, y'all, because this Four of Swords card is, like, fucked up. <laughs> but, yeah. Like, your, your ancestors guided you to the path of healing, the path of self-love, self-discovery. Okay? A lot of you maybe uh, are being guided to do more meditation here. You could be in deep meditation. You're like in this meditative state where you're just attracting all sorts of luck. You're attracting a lot of good things happening. A lot of good things are coming towards you, okay? Your ancestors helps you heal tremendously. It's people that literally left you for dead. It's people that literally prayed on, still praying on your downfall. And they are fucking confused because they like, why isn't this working? Why, after I betrayed the collective, they still happy, smiling, like ain't nothing nothing ever happened, all right? It's the power of the divine, all right? You the chosen one. Let's get some energy. Clarify copycat spirit. Clarify copycat. Clarify copycat. Okay. Ah, <laughs> Yeah. Ten of Wands energy here. October could be highly significant here. All right. But with this Ten of Wands, uh, Leo, Sagittarius, Aries could be highly significant to this reading. All right. But with this Ten of Wands, it, it's a struggle. Okay. This person that's uh, that's in this energy of copying, imitating, trying to emulate your energy. It's a struggle trying to keep up with you. Like I said, you're the blueprint. You're the original. This person is struggling trying to keep up. With a lifestyle, trying to keep up with an energy they could never possess. Speak, spirit. Speak. All right? You have this. This person is in shambles here. Trying to keep up with you. Trying to emulate your style. Trying to emulate your energy. All right? And it's a struggle. It's a burden. It has become a burden. And it's a lot of people that's realizing. It's a lot of people that came to the realization that this energy is copying you. This energy is trying to emulate everything you do, but swear up and down they can't stand you. It's sick, okay? It's giving, it's giving very, like, it's not giving at all. <laughs> Knight of Cups here, okay? You have a lot of offers coming in, a lot of suitors, a lot of people interested in you. A lot of people interested in getting to know the real you. All right, because upon you stepping in your energy, you literally have to take your power back from every motherfucker that was playing on your top, playing in your face. And upon you doing this, people see the genuine, true you. People see that you are your true, uh, your true, authentic self. People see that it's a copy, it's a person out here emulating your energy, trying to copy you. This person is looking very foolish here. You could be connected to a water sign. A water sign could want to make an offer to you. You could be dating a water sign at this time. Water sign energy. Like I said, three of cups, okay? A lot of you guys are manifesting your soul tribe. Yeah, but these people see, like, you're you you're just, you could be celebrating something. Maybe your child had a birthday. You're celebrating some type of anniversary. You're set of celebrating the growth of a business venture or you're opening a business. But you're just in this energy of, of celebration, embracing. You're embracing this new positive change that's that's um, headed towards you. That's your end. You're in the midst of this. Okay? These are people too. People, the energies that's emulating you. These are energies that you ate with, you 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 celebrated with, that you communed with, okay? A Pisces could be highly significant. What's the energy spirit? Like I said, it said your ancestors are all over this. That's why this person feel burdened. Your ancestors pay somebody a visit. Someone feel burdened from try, trying to emulate and copy you. It's a burden trying to keep up with the great. Because <laughs> you, you. Can't nobody do you like you. You got people out here trying to be you better than you. Make it make sense here. It's not making any. Leo, Sash, Aries, energy. There's too many. Spirit. Let's get some energy. Make it make sense here. 
making it make sense here. A Scorpio could be highly significant. That's too many spirit. Let's get some energy spirit. <laughs> spirit. Spirit said make it make sense. Like, for real, for real. <laughs> okay, spirit. What's the vibes? What's the vibes? It's people emulating you, copying your style, your swag, your lingo, but don't want to pay you any recognition. Don't want to pay respect. Don't want to give credit where it's due here. Your ancestors all over this. They, they motherfuckers will respect you. They going to respect you, period. You may even have people, like if you, I'm picking up on a reader. If you are a reader, you may even have readers that may have a bigger platform than you that steal from you, copy you. So a source energy. Libra, Gemini, Aquarius energy here. Yeah. You have a lot of, like I said, these people that they want to, they don't want to pay record. They don't want to give credit where it's due. Okay, they don't want to give credit where it's due. These people are very, it's my fact, it's very inauthentic. These people are unhealed, inauthentic individuals that's copying you. All right? Very, very deceptive, hateful, envious, malicious, trying to compete where they simply don't compare. All right? A lot of people are being blocked out your energy. It's a lot of people sending you evil eye here with this five of swords. A lot of people send, sending you evil eye. All that shit getting blocked off by your ancestors. Like I said, your ancestors are all over this. Okay? They are on top of this. Jealousy is very dangerous. Envy is very dangerous. Okay? People, an uh, envious, jealous person will do some, could do some very malicious, cruel, wicked shit. All right? That's why your ancestors not taking, they not playing no games. They not playing no games. What's the vibes? Two of Cups energy here. It could be someone jealous of your union or you're someone, you dealt with a lot of jealousy in your life. It was a lot of people even jealous of your connections, your unions, even if it, if it, if it was karmic at the time, okay? It's a lot of people that want to partner up with you. Like I said, people are now seeing you as who you truly are. Upon you taking your power back, people see you genuinely as who you are. And it's a lot of people you're connecting with your soul tribe, your soulmate. It's a lot of people that want to come towards you, that want to do business with you, that want to partner with you. Okay. You have a lot of people watching you. Like I said, trying to emulate, copy your staff, your style, your swag, your lingo, emulating you. For a lot of you, if you a reader that I'm the reader I'm picking up on, it's people with a larger platform than you that copy you that's still from you okay because they they know you're the abundant one you're the blessed one you have you're in this abundant type energy you have a lot of financial uh business opportunities coming towards you <clears throat> let's get some tito spirit what's the vibes what's the, what's the vibes it's no coming back from this, okay? Someone wants to come towards you that that your ancestors already um, the, like cut out of your life and they saying it's no coming back. Someone want to come back, but they can't, okay? Thief in reverse, okay? A thief has been caught. Someone has been caught. Wow, like I said, this person has been emulating your style, copying your swag. This person, people know the vice. People know that this energy is copying you. Because you're the original. You can't outdo the original, okay? Someone has been caught. Someone has been found out. We have DNA here, all right? You, you come from a very rare, your genetics, your lineage is very rare, okay? The initials D, N, and A could be highly significant here, okay? Something very rare, rare about your genetics. You have royal DNA. You're one of the originals, like I said. It's someone that's been trying to steal your light, steal your energy. People already know the vibes. People know that this person is copying you. Miners, look, y'all, I can't make this uh, minor and sense spirit, spirit here. Minor and sense spirit here. 
this person study you like a book you have somebody literally studying you like a book trying to copy everything you do okay watching your every move this person can't post and tell you pers post this person can't move and tell you move this part person can't bust a move and tell you bust a move it's sick spiritual this is a spiritual liability here It's a burden for this person to try to keep up with you. They cannot try to, they can't compete where they don't compare. Like, what the fuck? This device, that kind of pissed me off. Spirit, look, this fell on the floor. Spirit said, they really should be ashamed. They are embarrassed because people know that they've been copying you this whole time. They embarrassed. Visionary. Okay? Visionary. You you already knew this. You already prophesized this. You already knew this energy was copying you. Monitoring you. Spiritually stalking you. Italian. You could be Italian. You could be mixed with Italian. Uh, Italian could be highly significant. You could be traveling to Italy. Um, you could have just made some pasta. You could be cooking pasta. Invite me over, okay? I love pasta. <laughs> or you could be going out. You could have just went to an Italian restaurant. What's the vibes? Let's get a few more. Then we're going to close out. We're going to get a... Let's get a few more... Okay. Karmic debt. Okay. Someone someone is li liable and due to pay some type of karmic debt here. This is a karmic that's been uh, trying to emulate your divine energy. A karmic can never. A karmic can never. Spiritual protection. You're, like I said, you're being protected from this person. I'm sending you evil eye. 1111 could be highly significant. November 11th is highly significant here. Let's uh, close out with one of these Soul's Message, Soul's Journey card. <clears throat> you see in 11, 11 a lot, a lot, you're going through a, another ascension, spiritual awakening here. You could be waking up at 11, 11. What's the vice? Why do I feel like it's 11, 11 right now? <laughs> No, hold on, y'all. I gotta see. If it's, is it 11 11? I, I don't know why I feel like that. Damn, no, nope, it's 1045. <laughs> I don't know why I just felt that. What's the vibe, Spirit? Let's get a closing message for my divine ones. What's the vibes? What's the vibes? Spirit, what's the vibes? Let's get a closing message. For the divine ones. Closing message, spirit. Okay, we have a few that flipped over. Trust. Okay. I accept the inner voice will always guide me correctly. Okay. Your intuition has been telling you about certain individuals. Okay. It's a lot of people that want to be you here. Okay. We have surrender. Spirit is saying these people need to surrender the energy of trying to emulate a divine energy when they are karmic, okay? These people also don't understand it took it took <coughs> you a lot to get where you are. It took a lot to get where you are. Yeah, happiness. Happiness. Okay? These people are truly not happy with, with their energy and with who they are. This is why they try to emulate you. But it, it's a need for you to always know you're the original. It's no carbon copies around here. They could try all day long. They can't copy your spirit, though. <laughs> Love you guys. Till the next video. Peace.